This video is brought to you by Osmocote, the planter's plant food. Wow. wow. Hi, I'm Mary Ann Bonetti, and I just clipped off a leaf from a hellebore plant that has black around the edges. Um, I usually remove all the leaves from my hellebores early in the winter time before they bloom, but this is one that I just now noticed because it's now later on in the um, winter season, it's February, and any time February, March is a great time to divide black mondo grass. Now this black mondo grass is actually not a grass. It's actually a member of the lily family. It stays black all year round here in the Pacific Northwest. It's actually the favorite plant of my husband's, so I have to keep it thriving and looking good. And you can see here, here are some little babies that have kind of wandered away from the huge hedge of black mondo grass that I have. And because it is early spring, I can just dig down. Now keep in mind, this is a member of the lily family. Lilies are bulbous plants. Now I hear that little uprooting of the roots. That means that the black mondo plant is going to have little tiny swollen roots like bulbs. And early in the spring, you can pull it up. Now look at that. See those roots? Those are, looks like little bits of potatoes. They're, they're bulb-like swollen roots. This is very easy. I can transplant this to create a new hedge of black mondo grass, or I can simply pop it into a pot right here, add a little bit of soil, and this makes a great perennial plant to share with friends um, or to put in little gift baskets. Now look at this clump. You can see how it's, I pull it apart because it travels. It travels sideways with these roots, and when you separate them, there's that little bulbous root. This can be replanted or potted up, and look at the beautiful black purpley berries on this black mondo grass. A gorgeous um, plant for borders. It stays nice and low. This plant grows in moist soil. It grows in shade, semi-shade. Uh, just make sure the soil is nice and loose and there's good drainage. And your black mondo grass will spread like mine did. I started with just one plant probably about 15 years ago. The more you divide black mondo grass, the more plants you get. So, early spring, February, March, maybe a little bit into April. When the weather is cool. Divide up your black mondo grass. This has been Mary Ann Bonetti with Easy Answers for Great Gardens.